what do you know about the, this LSU team besides the, the usual stuff? Everybody talks about them being real physical. What sticks out about them? Uh, you know, they got you know, really good defense. Uh, they don't make a lot of mistakes. Uh, we gotta, when they do make mistakes, you got to be able to take advantage of it. And, uh, you know, we got a really good game plan this week. Everybody's working hard. So. When you look at that Texas A&M film, do you ever look at it and see how the, you know, they're being aggressive, that maybe there were some things open that you just you just missed? And What do you take from this past game to learn from? Uh, you know, we got down really, really quick. Um, we weren't able to, to establish you know, a long scoring drive to keep the offense off the field or anything like that. And uh, when I go back and look at the film, you know, the pick out throw, and the fourth down we go to, we didn't get it. We score right there. We're right back in the game. It's like 21, you know, 21, 38, something like that. But uh, and then you know that gives the defense motivates them to make a stop and stuff like that. So you know you gotta take the positives from that game. And although you know our whole team did not play well at all, and uh, you know we left some points out there on them. On that, on that team. So uh, that game's in the past now, and we're looking forward to playing LSU. You guys have really struggled in the red zone offensively in these SEC games. Anything you can pinpoint right now when they still get shorter? No, I mean, you just got to score. Uh, we'll work on red zone tomorrow and uh, get better with that. But to win the games, you got to be able to score in the red zone. And we haven't been doing that. So, Tyler, Dan, you know, Coach Mullen says that it really depends on what the defense is giving you and you know, with what you can do. But, I mean, do you feel like you've got it a little bit, you know, a little bit more aggressive? I mean, and, and what I mean by that is just kind of start dictating tempo and then dictating a couple of things to keep the defense on their heels? Yeah, for sure. How do you do go about doing that? Uh, just like How, said, What are some just, things you can go about doing that? It just it goes back to film study, just kind of knowing what they're going be in before the snap of the ball, just kind of having an idea, uh, you know, just trying to get the ball out quick to help the offensive line and all the other guys and stuff like that.